Hi there, I'm Payam from Payam Data Recovery. Today you're gonna to learn a quick and easy way to match donor drives if you're trying to replace heads inside a failed Toshiba hard drive. Over the last 21 years we've been recovering data from Toshiba hard drives and um, not much has changed. Um, the good news is that matching parts and finding donor drives um, for Toshiba drives is probably one of the, one of the simplest and easiest um, out of all the different brands. So um, over the years I've tried different different methods, different techniques. Initially, um, I've got an example here at Toshiba Drive, so I'll turn it this way. Um, when I was a bit younger, I'd basically look for the, the same model number. In this case, it's MK1059GSM. And then I'd, I'd read on the internet and forums and news groups that you also had to match your second line over here with all these other characters. Um, and then also try and match the exact same country of manufacturing. Uh, and then even sometimes, you know, try and match the, the appearance of the labels or the barcodes, these symbols, that kind of thing like that. Um, and then this is a serial ATA drive. Um, if you've got a USB version also, yeah, it needed to exactly be a USB one. Um, the good news is um, over a process of elimination, um, we basically found that that was too specific and too strict. And as a, as a result, we used to buy hard drives that were very rare and hard to find and pay, for example, 200 US dollars for a drive that we couldn't find on eBay or Amazon or on the internet or through our normal suppliers. And when we relax the criteria a little bit, uh, and basically all we do now is basically match the, the model number, that's it. Um, and then instead of paying 200 US dollars a drive, we can often find lots of them available uh, on eBay, for example, for 40 US dollars or 30 US dollars, or lots of them that we've already got that we didn't think were compatible. Um, occasionally we find if that doesn't work, um, and I'd say that, that the, the rule of matching just the model number and nothing else is, is usually very reliable. At least 95% of the time, that'll give you compatible heads if you're trying to replace the heads inside a hard drive that's clicking or ticking or beeping. Um, if that doesn't work for some reason, you're getting some unusual symptoms, you may be unlucky. Um, normally then what we will try is actually look for a drive that also is made in the same country. Most of the Toshiba drives that we see, they're usually made in either Philippines or China. And usually you'll see that it'll say made in Philippines, for example, this one. Occasionally you're really lucky you get one made in Japan. Um, and um, we normally we'll try and match the model number and the country. So if I was looking at two of them on eBay and they were both the same price, I would try and get the one with the model number and country. There's more likely that it'll be 100% compatible. And even on some of the older ones, we don't really look at the newer ones, but for example, 80 gigabyte or smaller, we also used to match this last letter, which is the letter T in this example, on the, on the second line of the drive below the model number. Um, but it's very rare. Um, so if you get really desperate and you, you basically try a drive with the exact same model number, it doesn't work, try matching the country and the model number and if that still doesn't work as a very last resort if you get extremely rare drive that's very very fussy try and match that last letter below the serial number so i've got the a series of uh, letters in this case hdd 2k 11 z zk 01 then a space then t so try and match that last letter um and that's guaranteed for one of those three methods work. But generally speaking, model numbers enough um, and replace the heads. With Toshiba drives, we have a very, very high success rate with head replacement and clean room jobs. And over 95% of the time, we can temporarily repair the drive, get the data back, um, and there's not really significant damage on the platters on Toshiba hard drives compared to other brands that we see. Um, hope you found this useful. If you have any questions, please like or comment um, with this video. And uh, if you ever have a hard drive that fails and is making a clicking sound, um, definitely send it in to us. We offer a free assessment and quote, and we'd love to help you get your data back. No worries. Uh, thank you. Bye.